11.40, Friday. Figure I'd take a little ride. Haven't heard much on the radio. Heard there was a train in Beecher. Don't know if it was coming north, going south, but uh, we do know this line here is uh, a little blocked. So we'll see if there's a train around here. And then we're going to go down to Pembine. Maybe just take a little ride. Let's see if we can't go find some train action somewhere. I don't see nothing on either side. Nothing there. Nothing there. All right. CN tracks. I'm thinking that train that was heard in Beecher is probably going south and it was probably 501 with any more cars that they were able to pull off. As we come out on the 141, we'll find out, I suppose, if there's a train here or not. I don't see one there. Nothing down that way or to the right, so let's go to Cribbits. Just pulled into Cribbits, and I can tell you right across Highway 141, off the of Y, I just saw a whole bunch of uh, LP finished products sitting over there. They must have tucked them all into place. Also seeing a whole bunch of center beams, like the ones here on the right tucked in over in Wasaki. I don't see any power. I stopped off in Kribbis for a quick drink. Besides hearing the train just now, I wanted to look across the Y here. The Y is behind me can't quite see the why it's back that way you can just trust me on that but looking across the why across 141 this line used to go to Marinette Wisconsin as you can see they've got a bunch of uh, finished product tucked back in there anyway we better get over to where that train is because they're doing something Right, we're going back down this road again. I just heard the train. I don't know which direction he was going or where he's going. So we'll just come down here and pop a squat somewhere and look around. See what we find. Where'd it go? You heard it, didn't I? I heard it. Did you hear it? I swear I heard it. Did you hear it? I'm almost certain that I heard it. To go. Yeah, I'm definitely hearing them. Just don't know where they are. They must be in this southern yard. Oh, looky there. Found it. Well, I mean, it's only 50 miles from my house to here. 
it's the only locomotive that's uh, here because 502 is in Green Bay. I just saw that posted. I thought, well, maybe he's going to come over here and snatch these. I thought maybe they'd come over here and snatch these cars off right here, but I guess I should drive across the crossing over there and see if they kept going or what. Nope, he kept going. All right, 141, we're heading back north. We'll run up here to this overpass a couple of miles out of town and uh, see if it comes underneath. Guessing they must have gotten some more cars out of there. They were able to bring them south. But I don't know. No idea. You never do know with this railroad. Iron Mountain, 46 miles. Yeah, I wasn't kidding. And about two miles outside of Kurvitz, if you look over there to the left, you'll see that bridge over the train tracks. That's the first left you can make coming out of Kurvitz. Smith Creek Road. Anyway, we're gonna go over here and uh, see if we don't see it coming. I can't believe they're going back north with uh, nothing. Nothing at all. Nothing. I also can't believe there's no snow, but you know what? It is 46, 47 degrees. All the snow is going to be melting off. Well, I see the train. All right, let's go up here and turn around. I love the way the snow goes into the rows there. Ooh, I just see a rock pile. There's a rock pile down here. Little known fact, fluorescent sodalite AKA Uperlites that I'd like to hunt for along Lake Superior can be found naturally in rock piles and uh, glacier movements. Anyway, they are heading back, heading back north. I wonder why. They could be going up to Wasaki to grab some cars. Or they might be trucking it all the way back north. 45 miles probably from here. I don't know. What do you think? Alrighty. I don't think we're going to hit them at every crossing. I think we'll find a few select points and uh, I don't know, let's see where they're going. One engine's kind of boring across a whole bunch of crossings, don't you think? Or would you rather me get them at every crossing? Just power. Alright, we'll head on down and head north. Is he going all the way back north or is he going to Osaki, which is just around that little corner? We're about to find out. 
stick around. Somewhere in my mind, I thought it would be a good idea to come down this road. Oh my God, look at the behind me here. Remember me uh, talking about, I gotta roll my window up, oh my God. <laughs> you remember me talking about having bald tires? Yeah. Yeah, they're still bald. Oh, jeez. Oh, gosh. Oh, yes. Oh, sweet pavement. Oh, my gosh. I'm so happy to see pavement. Tracks are right to my right. I see uh, 501 up there. I was just kind of hoping he was maybe going to switch and grab some of these uh, tanker cars, maybe. Welcome to Wasaki. Yeah, this is a... I think this is old 141 here. And there's a side track, as you see right there. all these center beams they must have just tucked these in here because they were here the last time I was up here well to hear them again I thought this might be an interesting ride here. Get the train in motion. Coming through downtown Wasaki. Pretty cool. Coming down Division Street in Wasaki still. Neat old bridge right there. Yeah, you're probably like, where are you now? Where did you go to? I thought we were chasing a train. Stopped off here in Amberg at Dave's Falls. I'm, uh, I'm hopeful I can get to where the train trestle is that goes over this bridge or over this uh, river to catch the train going across. But I'm not sure yet. Oh, that's pretty cool.
Anyway, we get to go across this bridge. And then I gotta look at my map and figure out where I am. Oh, and I also gotta make sure I don't drop my phone. That's pretty cool, hey? Huh? There's a bunch of waterfalls that way, but as icy as it is and slippery, I'm not going down to see them. We're going this way. We gotta go find that train trestle. Oh, I'm just a hiking fool now. Oh, where's the river at now? If I keep slipping and sliding here. Okay, I see the train tracks out there. The river turns that way. Trestle, I think, is over there. So, I guess we'll, I don't know, wait around the rocks this way, that way. Yeah, I don't even honestly know if I can see where the train trestle is. I do know it's going to take me 20 minutes to hike out of here after this, so there's that. But I figured, you know what? You guys are getting pretty bored, I think, with some of my videos, maybe. Do a little more uh, hiking. Oh, dude. Oh, this... Oh, this is worth it. I don't care if it is just a locomotive. This would be so worth it. Oh, jeez. Yeah, buddy. Oh, this is gonna be crazy. Whoa, jeez, that's mud. Okay. Muddy. I'm not gonna show you yet. I'm teasing you guys right now, because I can see it. You can't see it right there above the screen if I just held it up just a little bit just a little bit you'd see that I hear a train. Do you hear a train? I might have got this timing almost perfect. Pretty cool ice chunks going down the river. Pretty neat just to watch. As the train comes across, we'll pan to the bridge. How are you guys liking the video so far? Here, let's go over. They never even looked over here. Anyway, this is one of the reasons when they're heading north or south near Amberg, they've got to slow down. They can't, uh, they can't cross that bridge any faster. Anyway, let's start hiking it on back out of here. Maybe we'll see if there's any cool sceneries or anything to look at on the way out. You guys going to stick around? We're going to catch up to that train, I guarantee it. He's going to go nice and slow from here. Walking back through. Oh, geez, puddles. There's ice everywhere. Everything's melting off. I think I'm the only person that's been foolish enough to come walking back here. Hopefully the video quality is a lot better for you. I did some adjusting. I am filming in uh, 
almost 4k but then I'm uh, dropping it down to 1080 with a 60 frame per minute rate per second per second rate which uh, makes the quality a lot better and the reason I don't keep it 4k is the man it's so much so much footage I don't know what I'm the word I'm looking for but uh, it's memory too much memory memory just kicks my butt not only that but if you don't have a 4k TV or a 4k monitor it's not gonna do you any good what are you gonna watch it on all right I'm gonna break trail on this one cuz I came from the top side and that was not fun so we're gonna take it slow try not to fall and have to find my phone to call rescue because I hurt myself anyway again this is Dave's Falls just south of Bamberg along Highway 141 I saw there's a park fee or something like that but I didn't see any attendants nearby so anyway pretty cool rock formations neat waterfall features I bet you the fishing here is probably pretty good too Back up to the bridge. Choose your path wisely. Again, everything's melting now, but it is a little slick. How are you guys doing? Good. Careful. It's really slippy back there. Yeah. Figure I'd film myself in case I fell. <laughs> Be a good video. And funny people hiding the beers in their hand. I mean, it is just afternoon, I think, on Friday, so... I guess the beer is okay. That's the way to the waterfalls. I don't think we're going that way, are we? Waterfalls. Rough train. Yeah, right. Oh, yeah. We got to go upstairs. Oh, jeepers. All this work involved. We'll get her done. Here's Halter on the move. before I found the train. Just off the road to the left. Still going. A little different shot from Holmes Junction Road.
Just noticed the taxi cab sitting there. Thinking this is going to be it. Taxi cab. Train coming. Fifty two degrees two twenty six. Two twenty six and fifty two degrees. Yeah, I guess they're gonna tie it down here for today. Or that taxi cab is just sitting there for no reason at all, but uh unlikely that wind is just booking huh folks. That's all folks. Anyway, hope you enjoyed this little chase today. Sorry I couldn't do more. Hopefully it won't be a week before we see another freight train, but until then, Make sure to hit that thumbs up, hit that subscribe button, hit that share button, and make a comment below. Yep.